The economy of Magingo Island revolves around a single precious commodity, fish. The waters surrounding the island are teeming with Nile perch, a valuable export. Fishing is not just a livelihood, it's the lifeblood of the island, shaping its rhythm and defining its existence. The fish trade on Magingo is a vibrant, chaotic affair. Buyers and sellers haggle over prices, their voices rising and falling with the rhythm of the trade. The catch is weighed, packed, and loaded onto boats, destined for markets on the mainland. The reliance on fishing makes Magingo vulnerable to the fluctuations of the market and the vagaries of nature. Overfishing and climate change pose significant threats to the island's fragile ecosystem and consequently its economy. Section 5. Shadows of Dispute, Territorial Claims and International Relations Majingo Island, despite its diminutive size, has been at the center of a territorial dispute between two East African nations, Kenya and Uganda. Both countries lay claim to the island, its strategic location and rich fishing grounds fueling the controversy. The dispute has led to tensions and occasional standoffs between the two countries. At times both Kenyan and Ugandan security forces have been deployed to the island, their presence a constant reminder of the unresolved issue. The Magingo Island dispute highlights the complexities of international relations, particularly in regions where borders are porous and resources are scarce. It's a reminder that even the smallest of territories can become entangled in geopolitical power struggles. Section 6. Resilience Amidst the Waves, Navigating the Challenges of Island Life Life on Magingo Island is not without its challenges. The lack of space, limited resources and constant threat of disease are just a few of the hurdles residents face daily. Yet the human spirit of adaptation and resilience shines through. The islanders have developed ingenious ways to overcome the challenges of their unique environment. Rainwater is collected and carefully rationed. Space is maximized, with homes built on stilts over the water. Community support systems provide a safety net for the vulnerable. The resilience of Magingo's residents is a testament to the human capacity to adapt and thrive, even in the face of adversity. It's a story of resourcefulness, community, and an unwavering determination to make a life for themselves on this tiny rock in the migration, resourcefulness, and the enduring connection between people and their environment. Section 8. A Tapestry of Cultures, the People and Their Heritage Magingo Island is a melting pot of cultures, a testament to the diversity of Lake Victoria's basin. People from various ethnic groups and nationalities call this tiny island home, each contributing to its unique cultural tapestry. The languages spoken on Magingo are as diverse as its people. Swahili, Luo and Luganda are just a few of the tongues heard echoing through the island's narrow alleys. This linguistic diversity adds another layer to Magingo's cultural richness. Despite their differences, the people of Magingo share a common bond, their dependence on the lake and their resilience in the face of challenges. This shared experience fosters a sense of community that transcends cultural boundaries. Section 9. The Lure of the Island. Why Magingo Continues to Thrive. What compels people to make a life on Magingo Island, a place with such limited space and resources? The answer lies in the island's economic potential, and the enduring allure of a life intertwined with the rhythm of the lake. For many, Magingo offers an opportunity for economic advancement. The fishing industry, despite its challenges, provides a livelihood for hundreds of people. The island's bustling fish market is a testament to the economic activity it generates. Beyond economic opportunities, Majingo represents a way of life deeply connected to the lake. For generations the people of this region have relied on Lake Victoria for sustenance and livelihood. Magingo, despite its challenges, offers a continuation of this traditional way of life. Section 10. Lessons from the Tiny Isle. The Importance of Understanding Magingo's Story. Magingo Island, though geographically small, offers profound lessons about human resilience, adaptation and the interconnectedness of our world. Its story is a potent reminder that even in the most challenging environments, life finds a way. Understanding Magingo's story allows us to appreciate the complexities of resource management, territorial disputes, and the delicate balance between human needs and environmental sustainability. It highlights the challenges faced by communities dependent on fragile ecosystems. Magingo's story is a call to action, a reminder of the importance of sustainable practices, conflict resolution, and supporting communities on the front lines of climate change. 
It's a story that deserves to be heard, understood, and learned from. Section 11, A World Within an Island, Concluding Thoughts. Majingo Island, a microcosm of human existence, challenges our perceptions of space, community, and resilience. It's a place where life unfolds at a frenetic pace, where challenges are met with ingenuity, and where the human spirit thrives amidst the waves. As we've journeyed through the life and times of this remarkable island, we've encountered stories of hardship, resilience, and the enduring connection between people and their environment. Magingo's story is a testament to the power of the human spirit, a reminder that even in the most unexpected corners of our planet, life finds a way. Let Magingo's story serve as a beacon, guiding us towards a future where sustainability, cooperation and understanding prevail. For in the heart of this tiny island lie lessons that resonate far beyond its shores, lessons that hold relevance for us all.